Right, Governor Scott has put some new emergency rules in place following Hurricane Irma and the death of 11 at the Hollywood Nursing Home. This meeting here in Delray Beach was to make sure that nursing home managers and assisted living managers understand how important those rules are. Our goals today are to ensure that everybody understands the new emergency rules. State Representative Emily Slosberg organized this nursing home and health care roundtable after 11 elderly people died after Hurricane Irma left their nursing facility with no power. The situation in Hollywood Hills is unacceptable. It is unacceptable. As a nursing home facilitator, you have the duty to be caring for your residents. And you, there's, it's unacceptable for, to allow them to sit and boil. Slosberg told the group of facility managers, first responders, and health care workers that while many of the area's facilities did have a backup plan in case of losing power. And when the storm hit us, we were ready. Many others were not. Bill Johnson, head of the County Emergency Operations Center, agreed. We wouldn't be in this situation today having this conversation, I believe, if people truly used plans, did that level of planning and that level of, of um, uh, emphasis on planning. Some facilities had a place to evacuate to, but that place also lost power. Others had problems with generators breaking down or running out of gas. Who's making sure that that's being done? Do you have an outside company that's coming in and testing that generator, or is that generator sitting there in the storage garage that you have? The group talked about providing battery-operated fans, checking on senior communities like Century Village, and basically making sure the elderly and infirm were protected in an emergency. It's important that we do everything we can to protect our most vulnerable, especially prevent loss of life. And one important rule the governor is pushing is he wants to require all of those facilities to have the ambient temperature following loss of power to be at 80 degrees or below, even if it's just in one room powered by a generator. Live in Delray Beach, I'm Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.